Some of my characters will dual wield. Some. <laughs> but you can imagine it will be like Fallon, last stand kind of deal. He's picked up an enemy assault rifle as well as his own and he's like backing off. He's covered in blood, you know, and then when they run dry, he's like, fuck it, and runs out. It'll, it'll be like a last stand kind of deal. And and also, it, it's the kind of deal where you don't aim. Yeah, yeah. I think that was the original reason why, why Jewel had two SMGs, is that if she came across a corridor, she could just flood it with bullets and in the confusion, do what she needs to do. Like, I don't think she's using them to be accurate. I think she is just using them to, for people to keep their fucking heads down. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'd duck and cover if some loon came at me with dual firearms. I'd be like, no, I'm staying the fuck away. I would stay down if somebody <laughs> came at me with one. <laughs> Yeah, but you, you'd stay even further down if there was two. <laughs> At that point, I would know there was two. Anyway, if, if, if anybody if anybody tries to if anybody tries to take take that point up for arguing, you're on your own. Okay, fair play. <laughs> and then I will go on the record and say, for the record, I personally think this idea won't fly, but we kept it in because cool. <laughs> I, I've got some of my own thoughts about dual wielding firearms and melee weapons, but that is a heavy discussion for another time. Probably when we get onto the Jasmines and the rogues of our universe. Danger zone topics. Not the scope of today's chat. No. Uh, Although I can already see this dual wielding section being a little one of those snippets that you put up, and I'm gonna uh, watch it back and be like, "Yeah, that's pretty funny." 